And the force of gravity between two objects depends on the masses of the two objects and the distance between the centers of the two objects. See, there's a gravitational force between you and Earth. There is also a gravitational force between you and the sun, between you and all the other planets, and between you and the people sitting next to you. But why do we fall down towards Earth rather than towards the sun, another planet, or the people next to us? Well, we don't fall towards the people next to us because they are much less massive than the Earth. Ah, but you might say the sun is way more massive than Earth. Why don't we fall towards the sun? Because the sun is much farther away. As the distance between two objects gets larger, the gravitational force between them gets smaller. So we stay on the ground because the force of gravity between Earth and us is larger than the force from anything else. When you are standing on Earth with your toes buried in the dirt, it may seem like there isn't any distance between you and planet Earth. But the distance is measured between the centers of two objects, not the edges. So the distance between you and Earth is the distance from the center of the Earth to about your belly button. So let's review. The more the masses of the objects, the larger the gravitational force between them. As the distance between two objects gets larger, the gravitational force gets smaller. And even when objects are at great distances from one another, gravity never quite gets to zero. It just may seem like there isn't any. 